experiencing a missing Live Translate button on your iPhone 17 or 17 Pro Max? You're not alone. This video will guide you through proven fixes to restore this essential feature, addressing common causes like software bugs, incomplete installations, and regional settings. We'll get you translating in no time. Several factors can cause the Live Translate button to disappear from your iPhone 17. The most common is a software bug in the iOS 26 update, which Apple has acknowledged and addressed with a patch. Another cause is a stuck or incomplete download of Apple Intelligence, the framework that powers Live Translate. This can happen during updates and requires restarting your device. Regional restrictions can also hide the button. Live Translate is not available in all countries due to privacy laws and server limitations, particularly in China and some Middle Eastern regions. Mismatched language or region settings in your iPhone can prevent the button from appearing. Ensure your settings match supported regions for the feature to work. Finally, occasional server-side or connectivity issues can affect availability. Poor Wi-Fi or cellular connection might cause the button to vanish temporarily. First, ensure the Translate app is added to your control center. Swipe down from the top right of your screen to open Control Center. Then, tap Edit Controls or the plus icon at the bottom of the Control Center to enter Edit Mode. In the Edit screen, scroll through the available controls and find Translate. Tap the plus button next to it to add it to your Control Center. Once added, close the Edit screen by tapping Done and swipe down again to check your Control Center. You should now see the Translate button for quick access to Live Translate. Live Translate relies on Apple Intelligence to function properly. To enable this feature, you'll need to access the settings on your iPhone 17. First, open the Settings app on your iPhone. You can find it on your home screen. It looks like a gray gear icon. Once in Settings, scroll down and tap on Apple Intelligence and Siri. This section controls the AI features on your device. In the Apple Intelligence and Siri settings, you'll see an option for Apple Intelligence. Make sure this toggle is switched on. If it's already on, you can proceed to the next step. If the toggle was off, turn it on now. After enabling Apple Intelligence, restart your iPhone to ensure the changes take effect and activate Live Translate functionality. Without Apple Intelligence enabled, the Live Translate feature simply won't work. This AI framework is essential for the translation capabilities on your iPhone 17. Verify that the Apple Translate app is installed and up to date. Open the App Store on your iPhone. Search for Apple Translate. If not installed, download and install it. If already installed, check for updates and install the latest version. This fixes issues caused by a missing or outdated app. To enable seamless offline translation on your iPhone 17, you'll need to download language packs directly to your device. This allows Live Translate to work instantly without internet delays or data usage, which is especially useful when traveling or in areas with poor connectivity. First, make sure your AirPods are properly connected and paired with your iPhone. While this step is optional, having AirPods connected enables voice-based translation during calls or conversations. Next, open the Settings app on your iPhone and navigate to the Bluetooth section. Here, you'll find a list of all your connected Bluetooth devices, including your AirPods. Once in Bluetooth settings, tap the blue Information I button located next to your AirPods name. This will open a detailed settings page specifically for your AirPods configuration. Scroll down through the AirPods settings page until you reach the Languages section. This dedicated area allows you to manage and download language packs for offline translation functionality. Finally, select the languages you want to download for offline use. Apple supports over 20 languages, including Spanish, French, Mandarin, German, and more. Each language pack requires about 100 megabytes of storage and downloads over Wi-Fi to ensure privacy and offline functionality. Once the language packs are downloaded, your Live Translate feature is fully ready for offline use. This means no data charges, instant responses without internet delays, and better privacy since all processing happens directly on your iPhone. This setup is especially valuable for international travel, business meetings abroad, or any situation where reliable connectivity might be limited. If the Live Translate button is still missing, 
Explore these alternative ways to access the feature. First, try using Siri with a voice command. Simply say, hey Siri, start live translation to activate the feature using voice commands. This works when Siri is enabled on your device. Alternatively, configure the action button on your iPhone 17 to start live translate directly. Go to settings, then action button. In the action button settings, select the translate option to configure it for starting live translate instantly. You can also still tap the translate button in control center if it's visible after applying the first fix. If the live translate button is still missing, start by double checking your region and language settings for compatibility. Live Translate works best in supported regions like English-speaking countries and select European markets. Next, make sure you have a stable internet connection. The feature requires downloading language packs to enable offline translation capabilities. If these steps don't resolve the issue, contact Apple support for further assistance. They can help with specific device problems or software bugs. Thanks for watching this guide on fixing the missing Live Translate button. Enjoy seamless translations on your iPhone.